The 4th of July just around the corner. Clark County is trying to crack down on illegal fireworks. 8 News Now anchor Christiane Klein joins us now live in studio with that story. Well, Clark County Sheriff's Office, Fire, and the City of Las Vegas are teaming up to inform the public about the dangers of illegal fireworks in a series of new public service announcements. The new interagency initiative is called You Light It, we write it. The public is encouraged to report complaints about illegal fireworks online at www.ispyfireworks.com instead of 311 or 911. Now, this helps free up 911 for life threatening emergencies only. Last year, fireworks caused 13,000 injuries. Every year, they cause an average of 18,500 fires in the United States and $43 million in property damage. Only fireworks labeled safe and sane are allowed, and only from July 1st through July 4th in unincorporated areas of Clark County. This year they're exploring a civil fine versus a criminal fine, and it could be very expensive in, in violation of that, so the court system would go at, after you civilly if we determine that you're the owner of the fireworks and you've um, deployed them. So just how much? Well, if you're caught using illegal fireworks, you could be fined up to $1,000 and disposal fees. Las Vegas is also looking at imposing additional civil penalties. First offense, $250, and the second, $500. That'll be discussed at the upcoming city council meeting. Any fireworks purchased outside Clark County are likely to be illegal, including vendors in Pahrump, Amargosa Valley, and the Moapa Band of Paiutes. If you buy from Moapa, you can shoot it off from a designated launch pad outside the store. But absolutely no fireworks of any kind are allowed at Mount Charleston, Lake Mead, Red Rock, or any other public land. And this 4th of July, keep in mind that pets, other animals, and those suffering from PTSD may also have trouble with fireworks noise. Back to you guys. Still ahead.